The deadliest tornado of the 21st century and the seventh deadliest in U.S. history struck only three years ago. Joplin, Missouri witnessed the EF5 multi-vortex tornado on the second day of a six-day long severe weather outbreak. It was a hot, humid Sunday afternoon across the middle of the country. In the morning, the Storm Prediction Center issued a moderate risk of severe weather stretching from northeast Oklahoma into Wisconsin. Low pressure centered over South Dakota and a cold front ahead of it were pushing east. This would serve as the starting point for thunderstorm development. A little after 5.30 local time, a tornado had formed southwest of Joplin. From there, it traveled east-northeast into the southern side of the city. This is where the tornado was most intense and the most deadly. In all, the tornado was on the ground for 38 minutes, traveling 22 miles. In less than an hour, more than a thousand were injured and 158 people lost their lives. There hadn't been a storm this deadly in more than 60 years. For Storm Shield, I'm meteorologist Jason Myers.